guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 19. I cannot take myself seriously. I am about to go get my nails done. It needs to happen. I'm gonna be trendy today. Just wait, guys. All right, I'm gonna listen to a podcast, get my nails done, might get my car washed. It's gonna be a good day. Tonight I'm getting dinner with Julian Hunter, which I'm excited for. Okay, here are my nails. I love them. I go to Castle Nail Salon. Um, yeah, I think they're so fun. I feel very trendy. Hi guys, I have been trying to vlog this specific clip for like 10 minutes and I just can't do it. Anyways, I'm leaving the nail salon. I'm going to Trader Joe's. It's a gloomy day and I want to make a soup. I found a new recipe and I'm excited. But I wanted to say something that I left out on accident of yesterday's vlog when I had the talk just about like the holiday blues and all that stuff is that I've also been feeling extremely unmotivated, which I feel like at this time of year, I'm actually like normally really inspired and excited. And I don't know if it's just kind of like a little bit of burnout or whatever it is. Anyways, this morning, I don't know. I listened to a podcast and I got out of the house a little bit and I just, I I feel like I'm I feel more motivated and I feel like I'm going to feel very motivated come the new year which is good I actually listened to pretty basic with Natalie and I loved the episode oh, oh my god I love that car just what's your dream car everyone comment down below this car I mean the lights are very bright oh another thing I feel like 95% of the time I actually really love spending time alone I've for sure become even more introverted in something that I don't really talk that much about and I feel like people don't really take seriously coming from me if you know me personally because I am like very outgoing and if I want to I can work a room and it's really easy but I have like two opposite sides to me I'm either the most outgoing person that you've ever met or I'm just like really chill and I don't really have I don't know it just depends it also depends on who I'm around because if I have friends who will be outgoing and I don't have to be outgoing then I won't do it and honestly, it just there's a lot of factors in it. Anyways, with that being said, I become a lot more introverted. Also, I do have social anxiety. It actually runs in my family, which is something I didn't realize until I got older. It's I feel like because I am or I can be and I am a more outgoing person, it's not really obvious. And maybe that's why I'm outgoing. I don't know. It just depends. It's like a I don't know. It just depends. What I was saying was that normally I really love spending time alone. I actually prefer it. I thrive off of full days just spent by myself. I love the whole routine of it and whatever. And I don't know if maybe it's because I've been off my routine or I haven't really been doing the things that I normally love to do when I spend time by myself or the holiday season. Or I just been feeling weird the past few days and maybe I do just need to like go see people, which I will be doing this week. I'll be with my family. Anyways, I am back to feeling good spending time by myself again. I don't know why I was in that weird like few days slump. I was just kind of down and maybe I like credit it to that. Anyways, now I'm excited to go home, cook my soup and just do whatever I feel like. You know, it's a Saturday. I don't have much to do. Besides tonight, I have plans with Julian Hunter, which I'm really excited for. All right, I'm back home. I'm actually going to try to make some broccoli and scrambled eggs. So random. I saw it somewhere yesterday. I can't remember who. Wasn't my own thing. I saw it somewhere. Anyways, I'm gonna try this out, see how I like it as a snack, and then as like my really late breakfast because it's already 1 p.m. All right, I put way too much broccoli in here, but it honestly looks and smells really good. Okay, guys, I'm starting on my soup. We just started with olive oil, onions, and then some chorizo. I'm going to add in the seasonings in a few minutes and then the rest of it. You guys will see. But I'm also going to make an Instagram reel. So again, always go follow my Instagram because I feel like that is the best place to follow me if you want recipes. So I seasoned and then I just added all of the potatoes. I'll actually just show you. I'm just making sure that these are all coated. Now I'm adding in the chicken broth. Guys, honestly, I kind of forgot to vlog, um, but I let this simmer for about 20 minutes. And then I just added some whipping cream and kale. I believe that's it. But again, the reel is on Instagram. It's sm it smells so good, guys. Like, oh my God. I have been laying here doing nothing but watching TikToks. I just postmated myself some Starbucks so I would have energy, but it's almost 4 p.m. and I'm going to shower. I'm meeting Julian Hunter at around 6. 
and I want to give myself a blowout with my Dyson. I just got out of the shower. I showered. I used Rose and Argan. Okay, so I forgot. I don't know how I forgot because I've had this product before. The Rose Argan, the Lush product that I love. It's not a lotion. It's like a body conditioner. You use it in the shower and then you like shower it off. And then the whole point is that it leaves your skin so moisturized, which it really, really does. Um, so I used it correctly this time. You guys reminded me. My Starbucks came. I cannot tell you the last time I had a Starbucks drink with whipped cream on. But when you order Postmates, when you order Starbucks on my Postmates at least, like I couldn't even get the Irish cream cold brew. I can't order it. It doesn't like allow me to order drinks in the way that I would want to. So I just got this. This is the Binti Ice Cinnamon Dolce Latte. It's definitely a treat. It tastes good. But if I'm going to do anything social at night, I like have to chug a cold brew. Because I'm used to going to bed at like 8 p.m. Anyways, I think I'm gonna wear. I feel like it's like a little bit dressy, but like I'm gonna I'm gonna try to dress it down. When am I gonna wear this if not tonight? Guys, also, I would love to redo my bathroom and just make it like such a bougie, nice experience, but I just don't know if it's worth it. And I feel like I might be putting too much money into this house if I do that and the kitchen. Gonna finish listening to my podcast, drink my drink. I'm having one of those days in my house where I feel like this is what you dream of when you're like 15 and you want your own place when you're like in your 20s you know maybe i should like live that life it's like the main character life but like you know the 15 year old's dream of living on her own which i'm already doing that <laughs> to do it well in I couldn't tell you how long because normally I'll do like if I do an everyday look it's like more natural why is this not opening I have this morphe palette ooh um I'm not the best at makeup so like please don't bully me in the comments below but I want to do like a very neutral eye with maybe some like winged out liner but eyeshadow is liner so, yeah. do you know what I'm saying I'm not using eyeshadow primer because I don't have any, but do you guys remember when eyeshadow primer was like the biggest thing also? They play. Guys, I'm just in the best mood. The fireplace is on, my house is clean, some candles burning, my favorite candle. Oh, it just feels great. Anyways, does anyone else remember when it was like the biggest deal ever to um, wear eyelid primer? Does everyone still wear eyelid primer? Eyeshadow primer? Okay, I'm gonna do like the same color all over my lid, just like a little more neutral look. I like how it's so simple. And then, this is gonna be interesting. I'm gonna try to get like a darker brown and wing it out. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to. I don't know. This is like not working. I'm gonna watch the tutorial and get back to you guys, okay? I clearly gave up on the eyeliner. This is the makeup look. Simple, easy, nothing incredible. I'm not that good at makeup uh, at all. All right, guys, I'm dressed. I actually am wearing this because the other outfit was too hot, but this white sweater, which honestly really reminds me of the ones I used to sell at Limited 2, is from Revolve. These are my favorite jeans from Princess Polly. They're the best jeans ever. I'll have them linked below. And I don't know if my discount code still works, but if it does, I'll have that down below as well because then you can get them 20% off. My favorite boots I wear every day, my favorite coat I wear all the time from H&M. So that is the look for today. Just wearing this bag. I am about to head to Beverly's to meet Julia and Hunter, and I will take you guys along. Cheers, team. It's so cute here. Hi. <laughs> So good, I got salmon. I saw it one time on your Instagram. <laughs> Someone commented like, this like mirror hallway is iconic and you honestly saved my Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, because I... <laughs> okay, guys, ready? No, wait, because it actually really did. Like... Here, I didn't look like your Ready? Yeah, no, like actually save my Instagram because it's so easy to take a mirror picture. Mm -hmm. And I yeah. hate asking people to take photos of it. Oh, I know. 
So it was just like so helpful. Well, oh, guys, we're on the rooftop. Fitz is up here. Hunter carried him up because he's afraid. Look at my plants that have literally not. Well, the well, those are need to be uh, watered really bad. The mums, see, it's uh, the winter. I'm gonna say, yeah, yeah. you know, are hard. very like difficult. I got very excited, and yeah. I was like, I can do it. And then, no. yeah, I One quickly week, you're realized. Like, I'll water it every morning, and then you fall off. And then I'm like, wait a second, that just like didn't work out for me. Yeah, yeah. it's no joke. And stuff. How many times did this break? Oh my god. Well, do you, so many times, but like do you have the Oh, why so kit? wide? You have to get the eyeglass cut oh, because uh, yeah, for the screws. That's like what I do. All, I would yeah. always do it. But like most people's are like literally like Jump. there's duct tape yeah. on them. I am actually crying. Look at Fitz right now. <laughs> He's so cute. It is currently 11:02 p.m. So, I need to do my skincare routine. Julia and Hunter just left. We had like literally the best night, honestly. It was just so nice spending time with like people in general, but also I just love them. I think I'm actually gonna see Julia tomorrow too. I think that there's something on my lens. So, this is day 73 of me not bringing my comforter up to my bed. I know, eventually I will do it, but I think I'm going to McKinney tomorrow and then I'll probably see Julia. I'm not sure what the actual like game plan is. I think tonight I'm actually going to edit this vlog to get it up in the morning so then I can just do whatever I want tomorrow. Tomorrow is Sunday. Oh, I just, he's so cute, guys. Does it annoy you how much I like point out my dog in vlogs? He's just perfect. Hi, Coco. You're such an angel. So, anyways, I'm gonna take you guys through my nighttime skincare routine and what I have been doing. Oh, whoa. Oh, my. This is. Oh, oh my gosh. That's not okay. This is like my night cream that I use. Um, anyways, I am doing a video with him soon, so I'll talk about I'll talk about this more in an upcoming video. But when I use this stuff, it makes my um, skin tone and my skin texture like so even. It is so amazing. All right, turning all this off. I just cannot believe he's so perfect. How does it feel to be the most perfect? Handsome man ever. Oh my gosh, guys. Hunter was helping Fitz. He, Hunter and Fitz really bonded, and he was helping bring Fitz up to the rooftop, and Fitz was so afraid when he was coming down the staircase. Here I am with my slippers. I don't even work my phone. Oh, over here. All right, so, shoot. I just realized that I don't have my cord. Okay, so I'm gonna get to editing this vlog every night you guys have seen my night routine but see it's already on there i always put on okay i don't like this particular um video but always a fireplace my lights i'm gonna turn this off and this is my editing vibe that is it for today's vlog i hope you guys enjoyed i love you guys so much and i will see you tomorrow bye